Are you intuitive? The question is actually a trick question. So I wanna break down a couple of different ways that you can tell if you are actually connected to your intuition. Hey, I'm Cole Bambino, a founder of The Freedom Project, and you are in the right place if you're looking to consciously create a life of freedom. Don't forget to hit subscribe to this channel to keep hanging out with me week after week. So right now I have something super special going on for just a few of you. I'm actually open the, opening the doors to my private energetic work and coaching. I haven't done that in over a year for anybody outside of the Freedom Project. So if it interests you to deep dive into breaking past your limits, getting to the root cause of what's holding you back from your next big breakthrough, then email me at colebambino at gmail.com and we'll get to see if this is the right fit for you to dive deep into work with me. So with that being said, I want to get into our topic today of intuition. And the question I want to ask you is, are you intuitive? What do you think? Do you think you're intuitive? The question is actually a trick question. Of course you're intuitive. Every single one of us has the power of intuition within us. It is absolutely within you to let your intuitive channel open so that you can guide and lead others fully, so that you can connect with others deeply, and so that you can be in your power in your life and know with clarity which direction is right for you. You are absolutely intuitive. So I wanna break down a couple of different ways that you can tell if you are actually connected to your intuition. So one way that intuition comes through is knowing. This can be the most confusing way because it actually can sound just like your thoughts. But it's not just your thoughts, it's information coming through you, guiding you in whatever it is that you need the most support in, in that moment. This is called knowing. So really asking yourself, is this a knowing or is this my thought, is going to be something that helps you tap in to that knowing intuition. Another one is sensing. So maybe you're a coach, you're an influencer, you're a leader, and you find that when you work with people, or speak to people, all of a sudden you might feel something in a part of your body. Maybe you feel a gut reaction or you feel a pinching in your heart right as this person across from you is talking about heartache. Or maybe they're talking about not feeling strong or feeling weak and you feel something in your gut. This is your body sensing what is actually going on with the individual in front of you. And the two really famous ways that a lot of people hear about is clairvoyance and clairaudience. That means you receive your intuition by seeing visually or you see, receive your intuition by hearing. So there are so many different ways that you can be tapped into your intuition. Just because you don't see visions or you don't hear your spirit guides speaking to you doesn't mean you're not intuitive. So my invitation to you this week is to own, yes, I am intuitive, and start checking in which are the ways that my intuition is speaking to me. If you found this video helpful, hit like. If there's something you got out of it that you wanna share with me, post a comment below, and don't forget to hit subscribe to get more videos like this every single week. Remember, stay committed to your next big breakthrough because with every breakthrough, you ascend into higher levels of who you truly are. And as you step into who you truly are, you are free. And believe me, the world needs a free you. So much love and light to you always. Peace.